What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. And today we're gonna to talk about Safarian holster mods, specifically for the Parker Mountain Machine, Charter Grade P320 Comped Pistol. Before we get into this, let me tell you a little bit about what we do here at RDR Gear. We're a soft goods manufacturer. We specialize in plate gears, placards, chest rigs, a full line of professional grade canine gear, as well as EDC belts, Kydex holsters, and of course our Safarian holster mods, holster wraps, and of course, holster accessories to enhance the performance of your Safari Land duty holster. With all that out of the way, let's talk about Safari Land mods on episode four of Safari Land U. So this is the new P320 Parker Mountain Machine Charter Grade. Gun is clear and safe. This pistol here is a little bit different. It's because it has this feature right here. This is the irons forward version to push this pistol uh, dot to the rear of the slide. The irons are forward to co witness the front sight, but to make this work in the holster, there is a mod that you need to be do to the holster to make it work. Otherwise, with the irons being right here in the front of the optic, the pistol will not lock into a standard P320 holster. This slide configuration is a flush fit on the frame, so therefore a regular P320 holster fits. There is really no other option other than simply making the mod on the ALS top end to make this pistol fit with the irons forward. We don't do anything with the actual locking mechanism of the holster. We do recontour the outside slightly to aid with the comp and the light. And of course, fixing it to where these edges right here on the corner do not drag on the internals of the slide. Uh, when we get to the full review of this pistol, we'll talk a little bit some of the contouring out here on the front of the comp. But right now we're gonna focus on this portion. If you have a charter grade P320 or a full size 320, such as with any kind of a compensator on it, the pistol holster you need is a standard P320 because there is no additional mods on the front end here. It simply is a flush fit on the full size P320. This here is a full size P320 frame with a full size P320 slide. Therefore, the factory holster needs no mods. The only time you're going to need a mod on this 320 holster is if you're running any type of optic with the irons on the front. Since this iron setup here is front, it does impede the lockup. Therefore, we have to tune that portion inside of the holster to fit this configuration. Once the gun goes in the holster, 100% lockup, no issue, bail covers, that's it. The only difference you're going to see on some of the holsters is if you're using a enclosed emitter such as the Acro, you're probably going to have a little bit of impediment on the hood closing 100%. But you're running at closed emitters you don't really need the hood to close simply the hood will come off and then you're good to go everything will stay the same gun will clear lock up and you're good to go every time this happens to be the 6360 rds 6360 is a level three so you have the sos bail running forward and then you have the aos model module to release the pistol lock up there drop the bail you're good to go there that's pretty much all there is to it if you do order this holster from us for this pistol, if you put tardigrade in the notes at the bottom of your order, I will offer this mod for free. Parker Mounds have been a great sponsor of the channel. They help us a lot um, on parts and things like that. So if I can do anything to help those guys out, getting their customers squared away with a bucket for their pistol, that's the least I can do to help those guys out. They've been very good to me um, and the channel. That being said, guys, this is the overall review modification for the Parker Mound machine charter grade pistol with the Safarland 6360 RDS holster for the P320 full size gun. This you can find on our website at rdrgear.com. Guys, if you have any questions, you can always email us at info rdrholsters.com. If you made it this far in the video, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, especially interact with us. It's going to train your YouTube algorithm to show you more content like this and others. And it also helps us and Crispy's efforts with the channel to grow. That's our mission this year. Until next time, be well. Take care.